this one's for six blinds with seven high for the min bounty. But you're folding for three blinds with a 300 bounty? Sullivan? Oh, I'm, t I'm on tilt, Sullivan. Ooh, it'll be nice to get out there. We're going to rejam the force. We want to get this bounty, right? Ship it. Send me that 50 bucks, man. And we'll keep going. To the moon, Dottie. To the absolute moon. 130,000. And even if you have no idea what's going on, no clue, I really encourage you. Like, it is... You're going to be sitting with all old people. You can take a book for intermission if you want, whatever. For like 10 bucks. Do you want to double barrel here and go for the bounty or check? I think probably check. What do we beat here? Queen Jack. We beat all the 8x, 5x, 6x. 8-7, seven, 6-7, seven. they could turn those hands into bluff. 8-9, although we block pretty heavily. Probably a river call. Definitely for 20,000. Who's ace king? So did they go for the induce the squeeze? Oh, no, they three bet pre. Oh, okay. They bet flop. See, I definitely thought this hand played out differently. I thought we raise pre, they called. With they three bet pre, they bet flop, we call, and the turn comes to hand, I would jam the turn. But they would fold, right? So like, yeah. I definitely thought this hand played it differently. I thought they flatted preflop. Thank you, man. I'll listen to it later. Appreciate you. Our 6-5 straight. When's the pot? 166,000. For 10th place, 14 left, 11 pay. This is the soft bubble in the Super 320. Let's go, baby. We missed on the river. Do we want to go for the bluff? No. Stuck in between two on the soft bubble is not where you want to be. We're not really happy with our position right now. The kings, we're going to go all in against ace-queen in the 215. Looking good, and it is good. 130,000 there, okay. We turn a double gutter. A three or a seven will give us the best hand. Get a very small lead from Kaizen. It kind of forces Thury to call with all their overpairs here. They can't really raise. Which is good news for us because we probably get to see a river and draw. Which is what we want to do here. Hit it with the three. Hopefully this is like spade draw 4x and we win. That'd be cool. Six, aces, five. Cool. All right. $100 bounty coming our way. We were a little slow on the call there, but I was just busy doing that. So sorry about that, Kessler. I didn't mean to slow roll you there. My bad. Um, 200000 though. Good spot. You're in the money. Oh, I am in the money. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. So min raise is... I don't think we can fold anything for the min raise, even a hand as trashy as jack five. In position 12 blinds deep, blind versus blind, like just too valuable to flop like top pair, you know? So just a four or an eight or a jack. There's a decent amount of outs there, I'd say. If they check, I like a little bet. If they bet, I like a call if it's small and a fold if it's big. All good, TC Hansenberg, all good men. So we take it down there in the turn, which is beautiful stuff. 120,000. Nine of 10 on the final table bubble. Ace, king, king, jack. I think this player busts. Pretty sure. Yep. Yes, they do. Bah! Final table hype of... The Super 320, coming into the final table 9 to 9, but don't sweat it, it's fine. First place is going to be anywhere from four to 6,000, depending on how well you do in bounties. Good luck to us. Queen 10, Ace Jack, we want Queen 10 to survive here, I think. Uh, I mean, ladder's fine too, but like, we would like the bounty. All right, we are down to eight. Shh, let's raise tens. And start with the check call.
We win a small pot against Ace Four. This is it in the 320. This is where we get our stack moving in the right direction against busting the nut. All in with nines in the super 320. It's king queen. We've got a flip. Good start. Keep it low. Let's go. How do we want to play this hand? Shortest stack significantly. Yeah, I think it's just an all in. There's going to be a decent raise fold gap here. And yeah, they're going to call with ace, king, ace, queen, and jack's plus, but I think it's enough of a raise fold gap. We're okay. We hit an ace, which is just gorgeous. And we're on the bubble here as well, so I'm going to put this in the bubble felt. All right, over to the ace, queen. Good hand. And we could raise call against tactic. Three bet against bust and nut. No, it's actually flat against bust and nut here. We don't want a three bet call... I don't really want to jam on a final table. On a non-final table, I like jamming. But it doesn't make a ton of sense here. I think call. I can call a squeeze here. And I can Sullivan fold, I guess. And we go to a flop of 7-3-2. Holy big bet. What? Could be a combo draw, but I don't think there's enough upside anymore. Uh, limp call. There's like the right option pre here. It's a pretty good hand. If they jam, we fold, obviously. But if they raise less than all in, that's fine. Flop is jack seven deuce. Probably call on the river. Uh, it depends on sizing a little bit, but I don't love seeing the big sizing. But here's the thing, right? It's blind versus blind. They take a free check in the big blind. Um, it eliminates some of their aces for sure. Backdoor diamonds is a thing. Uh, but we bet flop and they call 10-9, 10-8, and 9-8. It's such a huge part of this range. Especially when they check back pre. They don't have pure ace X, right? Like a lot of ace X is just going to raise. Not all of it, but like over half of it. So I think we have to call here. Let's go. I think I have the coolest piece of poker software you've ever seen today. It is called Hybrid Poker brand new piece of poker learning software where you test your score against myself, against Daniel Negreanu, against Bill Perkins, and see how you score against the three of us, as well as other poker players as well. But Hybrid Poker learns about you, the player, which is, this is really cool. As Hybrid Poker gets to know you, it's going to tell you what to work on. There's a link to the IQ test down below. Try it for free. I think you'll like it. So try it out. I think it's a call. This this eights, if we jam, they're gonna fold sevens, right? Which case I don't like jamming with the pair. I think it's better to jam with ace X than a pair here. But I also think it's too strong to fold. So it's gonna be one of the few hands that we flat in this spot. Um and play post flop, you know, basically. These spots are a little bit counterintuitive at final tables. On a non final table, of course, we've just slam dunked it all the all in the middle by now. On a final table, the incentives change a little bit here, even in a knockout. We've got to be worried about king jack suited, about ace jack suited, and about like sevens, eights, nines here. Check, check, and we win with the eights, which is really great news against ace nine. Let's go. And good news over here, we are in the money of the Super 215. 13 to 17, 219 cash plus our bounties which is 150 in bounties, which is much better than here, which is zero in bounties. Uh, pocket tens, we are all in, in the Super 215. <laughs> I don't like our chances against the flop straight flush draw. Uh, GG, 14th place, well, 400 bucks, right? 391, cool. 11 blinds, but it, there's not enough upside here to call. It's such a beautiful hand, ace 10 suited, but the upside is not there. Slight equity edge. And when we lose the 40% of the time, 45% of the time that we do, we are in last. Sad vibes. It was such an exciting hand on the button. Queens, ace, nine. We could lose a player here, which I think will... Oh, it's a big bounty, but like we can't try and get all the bounties ourselves, dude. We, we do want ladders as well. We're up to 513 in the prize pool. Six left. Big bounty on our left that we are sweating. Oh, it's the time, baby. It's the absolute time here. 
Come on. Do it! Oh. Ludzy. He's got a 75 bounty, but if we need to take it, we'll take it. Although I did win Playgrounds Friday 250 bounty. Let's go, Mogadu. Ship it, man. Congratulations, dude. Uh, King Ten Deuce. Check back with Queens. I think it's fine. Uh, the king is out there, but it's not like the majority of the range or anything. It's tough if they bet turn jam river, right? Like, that's the hard part. And probably, honestly, better to call with, like, ace-10 or 10-9 than it is called queens in that scenario. But they check in the turn, which is good. We check. Only controlling against, like, an ace river. There's four outs there. That's it. Um, control the size of the pot. If it checks to us on the end, we'll bet here. Expect to get a call from a 10, basically. If someone else rejams, it is a fold, and they do. It was going to be a call closing the action. Pretty sick. A check, queen eight. Queen eight gets it. Bounty's gone. We're down to five. We're in second place. All right. 619 in the prize pool. The jump started getting a lot bigger here. If they jam, we rejam. And if it folds to us, we honestly fold. It's not worth, this is a really interesting spot, but it's not worth it. When we cover everyone else, and there is 1,400 in prize jumps between second and fifth, and doubling up still has us at a three to one chip disadvantage on first. I think we just fold. Okay. <laughs> I don't, I don't. This one's for six blinds with seven high for the min bounty. But you're folding for three blinds with a 300 bounty, Sullivan? Oh, I'm, t I'm on tilt, Sullivan. Hold! Come on! Come on! 12 blinds, never in doubt. Seven or four, man. Hold. Hold. Yes. Goodbye to tactic. We're down to four. 784. Plus our bounties, which are zero dollars. However, Queen Nine suited is pretty good when you're on 5.7 blinds. It's good enough. Um, we do need to pick up some chips here. We're gonna hit the big blind next hand, which is gonna price us in a lot. Got to take the queen nine suited four-handed. Sometimes Sullivan folds here as well. Um, not this time. But it's only a mid-bounty that they're playing for. They potentially risk doubling up one of these opponents. So again, like this doesn't make any sense. They're folding for three blinds against a 300 bounty. I have no idea why. All right, GG. 784 finish. I don't know what just happened to that final table, dude. We were in a great second place of five, and we ended up getting fourth. Brutal. Okay. Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Until next time, goodbye.